If you're a web developer working on Windows and want to develop PHP and MySQL driven websites, you'll want to set up a testing server on your own computer. An easy way to do that on Windows is to use WAMP. WAMP is a free program that installs the Apache Web Server, PHP Application Server, and MySQL Database Server directly on your computer. With those three technologies in place, you're well on your way to developing PHP-driven website. To get started, visit the WAMP website at www.wampserver.com en. Once you get to their home page, you'll find on the right hand side a download for the latest version of WAMP Server. Click the link and you'll be taken to the downloads page. There you'll find a link to download WAMP Server 2.01. Save the file to your computer and once it's downloaded you'll be able to install WAMP Server. The WAMP server wizard is pretty straightforward. You have to accept the licensing agreement, choose where you want to save WAMP. By default, it's on the C drive or whatever your main hard drive is in a WAMP directory. Click the Next button, then click the Install button, and the WAMP installation process begins. Because WAMP provides network services like the Apache web server, you'll have to tell Windows that it's okay for WAMP to be able to communicate through your firewall. Click the Unblock button. WAMP also provides an SMTP or a mail server. You can set this up if you want or just click the Next button. When you're done, click Finish and you'll be taken to the WAMP server main page. This is the actual Apache web server running on your Windows machine, located at localhost. Every time you type in localhost inside of Firefox or Internet Explorer, you'll be taken to the web server running on your computer. WAMP installs a system tray icon which lets you start and stop the servers as well as open the www directory. The www directory is where you'll put your home page and all the other files for your site. By default, there's an index.php page there, but you'll delete that and replace it with your own files. It's located on the C drive in the WAMP folder inside of www. In this folder, you'll put your website. You can move files that you already have or build a website from scratch and put all the files in this directory. Here I'm copying over a website. Once it's in the www directory, all you need to do is launch your web browser and go to HTTP localhost. And there you'll see your website. That's all there is to it, to setting up WAMP.